previously on Skyrim, The Rise of Eldorast. I have recovered the Staff of Magnus and need to get it back to the college at once, where I can finally come into power there. So, let's see here. Uh, what would be the best way? Perhaps I should call upon my great powers of traversal. Once a source of pride for the people of Winterhold, the college is now shunned and feared, as it will ever more be when I am in control of it. The High King of Skyrim, Torig, is of no consequence to me. Yes, simpletons. Walk in freedom while you may. Forming the Dawn God, vampire. What in blazes is happening here? You survived. You have it then? Let's hope it's as powerful as the Sigics believe it to be. Where's Mirabel? And, um, who is she again? <laughs> she... she didn't make it. Okay. When it was clear we were going to have to fall back, she stayed behind and made sure the rest of us were all right. Now why are you all the way out here? Look for yourself. Ancano's power is growing. We can't crack whatever magic he's using to shield himself. I hope your trip to Labyrinthian was worth it. Very well, let us proceed. I'll be right behind you. Now let me see, what spells do I have equipped here? That seems to be some kind of basic lightning spell. Well, first... We shall prepare for use the Staff of Magnus. Absorb 20 magicka per second. If the target is out of magicka, absorb health instead. Excellent. I believe this will pair well with Flame Spark. There it is. Let me see here. Where am I? Find my components here. Flame spark. There we are. Yes, very good. And, uh... Staff of Magnus. Yes. Now we are ready. Hmm. Maybe useful later. Out of my way, simple tens. We never should have brought that thing. I'd be amazed if any of us survived this. I'd be amazed if any of us survived this. Ha 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 ha. You there! Gods, you'd better have something good up your sleeve. I've got nothing left. Well, you seem to be walking away quite casually. Are you sure you gave it the proper effort? <sighs> I suppose even the greatest effort by these fools would be useless. Ancano? Yes, I've come for you. You think I can't destroy you? The power to unmake the world at my fingertips. And you think you could do anything about it? Why, yes, I do. Behold the Staff of Magnus! And die! 
Hmm. Well, perhaps we could uh, share a word for a moment. No? Don't feel like talking? Well, then what about this? Ha! I am beyond your pathetic attempts at magic. You cannot touch me. Stop! Use it on the arm! Well, I am, Tolf, dear. Ah, that got your attention, didn't it? Very well. Come, then. See what I can do now. What the... Ah! Good blazes! <sighs> hmm. He has gained a, a not insignificant amount of power. Must keep on top of my healing. Mustn't underestimate this one. Let's see here. He does persist in using fire against me. Have I nothing to mitigate the effects? Ah. Here we are. Sixty seconds. All right, work quickly, old man. Ah, so he switched to lightning. Oh, is that my spell? I can't even tell at the moment. I have not affected him at all. Hmm. Perhaps I should change my tactic. Perhaps he draws his power from the eye. I must test my theory. Ah! Blast it all! Hmm, what am I doing wrong? I must consult the other worldly texts. Ah! Finally! Ah! Blast it all! Yes. He is gaining power from the eye, and the other worldly texts have informed me I must ensure that the eye is closed before I attack Ankano. But once it is closed, then he is vulnerable. Ah! Blast it all! Close! Close! This staff is nearly out of power! Ah! No. Ah, yes. I believe I've got him now. No. Yes! No. 
finally! Now, see what we have here. Yes, useful. Especially since this fabled staff of Magnus is nearly and so quickly out of magical energies. Hmm. Useful to sell, I suppose. Did you have nothing more useful on your person? Yes, well, have you nothing to say to me, huh? I knew you could do it. So did I. Now, <clears throat> what would you humbly, of course, suggest that we do now? I... I don't know. Ancano is gone, but whatever he's done to the eye doesn't seem to have stopped. I have no idea what to do. Big surprise. Ah... This one has returned. What have you to say, Quarania? We knew you would succeed. Your victory here justifies our belief in you. You have proven yourself more than worthy to guide the College of Winterhold. A little bit of a dinging! <laughs> I've got to keep my, the, phone on my, the, the sound on my phone on so that I don't miss any alerts about the PS5 being back in stock. So there's your little meta moment. If you hear any sounds from my phone going forward in this episode, that's why I will normally mute this. Well, I will mute this once I have a PS5. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> hmm. Yes. Well, I, of course, know and knew that I would be able to defeat Ancano. What was it about me? That made you realize I'd be able to defeat Ancano. A great many things obscured to you are quite clear to us. What? We have long believed you would prevail. Very well. What do you, humbly again, suggest that we do now? The eye has grown unstable. It cannot remain here or else it may destroy your college and this world. It must be secured. Ancano's actions prove that the world is not ready for such a thing. We shall safeguard it, for now. You now have the opportunity to maintain your college and carry on with your lives. You have our gratitude, Archmage. Yes. I, I pronounce it Archmage, but I suppose it. That's fine. <clears throat> you did say my college, yes? Did, did everyone hear that? My college? Archmage, right here. Yes? You've done it. The college is safe again thanks to your work. Yes. I knew you had it in you. As did I. I dare say the Sidics are right. There's no one more deserving to be Archmage, in my opinion. Here, consider these yours, and the Archmage's quarters as well. I shall be here for advice, should you need me. <laughs> Ah, oh, dear. Very well. Until next time. I believe I shall, uh, oh, take a look at my quarters. My quarters! Good to see Skyrim still has such fine people. You give an old man hope. Yes. Hmm. Quite a number of fine possessions that are now mine. Significantly, significantly among them, uh, some uh, quite useful components. Ah. 
Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, these will all be of some use on the market. Yes, very good. Hmm. Ah, I'm carrying a bit much though. Let's see. I should think there would be a place that I might store some of these possessions. Eh. And, uh, perhaps, uh, there a chest around here somewhere? Maybe something closer to the door? <laughs> Sounds like I have some, something going on in my tummy. <laughs> Where is this here? Then there's strips. Well, uh, I suppose this barrel over here will be uh, the best option for now. Perhaps this barrel right here will be suitable. Ah, uh, very good. Now, what might I set aside for the time being? Ah, these dragon bones. Ebony ingot. Hmm. That may be good enough for now. Ah, yes, I do believe I saw an enchanting table. Let's see. Drain heart sword. Excellent. I thought I might learn something new from this. A drain spell bow, yes. Absorb magicka from my opponents. Very nice. Hmm. Twenty-five. Twenty. So I believe I will deconstruct this one. Very good. Hmm. Yes, very good, and a bit of a weight off of my shoulders. That may be enough for now. What do you mean? Ah, oh, yes, they were. I stole them from where I found them before. I thought I would be stealing from myself somehow. That's. I, as I say, I do get mixed up from time to time. Hmm. See here. Hmm. I don't believe I'm wearing this at the moment. But neither would I like to leave it here. I believe that I shall have to visit my manor in the forest to unload some of these things that I do not wish to... What? Am I not wearing these now? All spells, 15% less, increased magic of 50, magic of 100%. Hmm. Is this, uh... Tw 
12 less. All spells, 15% less. Blast my memory, why did I not put this on immediately? Excellent. Not as aesthetically pleasing to my eye, but functionally, I cannot deny its value. Hmm. And what am I wearing this mask right now? It's a... Uh... Oh, I, I'm not wearing a mask. Let's see here. Ah. Uh... Magica by 50. Fire resistance. Hmm. 75% faster. Magica regenerates 100% faster. Time between shots reduced by 20%. It may still be the most advantageous bit of apparel to wear on my head. What? Are you telling me I cannot wear this and the Archmage's robes at the same time? Hmm. I do not like this choice. Magic is 100% fast. Let's see, I believe they both... Yes, they both have that quality, so this only... reduces the time for my shout. Very well. But might I wear something else? Such as a hood? No. I must commit to this... entire ensemble. Very well, I believe it is... Worth the cost to me for now. Let's see. One more look in my pack, see how much I'm carrying. I can carry about uh, 80 more pounds. I believe that may be enough for now. Perhaps later. I will uh, make adjustments to my inventory and... Visit the shopkeeper. I must consider my next move as Dragonborn. Yes, yes. Ah. I met the master of the Greybeards, the dragon Parthenax. He told me that the ancient Nords used an Elder Scroll to cast Alduin forward in time. If I can recover that same Elder Scroll, I may be able to use it to learn the Dragon Rend shout directly from the ancient heroes. I've learned that a scholar named Septimus Cygnus might know where to find it. Very good. Ah, I believe I shall explore the uh, further possessions of my new status at a later time for now. We travel onward to claim an even greater destiny for Elderast. There we are. Let's see. Believe a little trip to Sarthal will speed us on our way. 
trolls can be found in any region throughout Skyrim, both deep underground or wandering the wilds, presenting themselves to me to die. Perhaps one of them will present themselves here. Or another creature? What are these screeching bats I hear? Hmm. I believe for the time being I may be better served by having a double portion of flame spark at the ready. Oh! Blast it all! That such a simple creature would give me a start! Unacceptable! Unacceptable creatures die, all of you! None shall startle me! Now, I do think perhaps I should consider my life for a moment. Reflect on my various glories. Yes, creature. Go and be with your brother. Anyone else? Hmm. What? Let's see here. Ah. Perhaps this way? I... Well, how am I supposed to get up there? This is not what I would prefer. Ugh. Perhaps I should have approached from a different direction. So I have to take the long way around. No surprise. The gods seem bent on inflicting weariness upon me. But uh, once I come into my full power, I shall inflict far more than weariness upon them. For the injustices they have brought to my life... Uh, come on now. Yeah. Here we are. Yes. I believe this will serve my purposes. What manner of creature? Ice rake. Ha. Pitiful. Hmm. Not yet close enough. Shall have to go around once again. Ah, this bitter cold reminds me of my own prevailing bitterness, which soon all will share. Or perhaps even more preferable. They will cower in fear and awe. What creature is this? A giant spider, perhaps? Rather a large spider.
Good. Now. <clears throat> this would seem to... Ah, yes. Where are you, um... Uh... Let's see, what's your name again? Septimus Cygnus. Septimus! Septimus! Ooh. Well, this is what happens to weaklings who try to tread the path made only for Elderast. Septimus! Blast it all! Where the... Duh! Duh! Ah! Twisted my ankle there a bit. Ah, no. Down this way. Septimus! <clears throat> Septimus! I wonder what manner of person or creature did this. It may prove to be a worthwhile servant to me. When certain people need to be disposed of under my imperial rule. Septimus, where are you? Where is he? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself, Cesar. You always try to keep it for yourself. No, there's got to be more scoop. Shut up, shut up. Don't like me, Cesar. You're kidding. Always try to keep it. Hmm. Who have I found here? they gone to now? I know you're here. Hmm. If only Umana would have left one of these dwarven machine creatures intact for me to study. The fact that they almost killed those Khajiit brothers in the middle of the night doesn't mean we couldn't have found a way to disable one. We dragged some stuff in front of the pipes they came out of 
to stop them from coming back. They are simply fascinating. It is just as Calselmo described in Dwarves... What is it? Volume 2? Something insignificant to me. That appearance does in fact resemble that of an arachnid. I had thought that to be an embellishment given by his source. The inclusion of the soul gem into the design of the apparatus is quite remarkable. It could explain the focus for the lightning that he describes. Oddly enough, it doesn't appear to be the main power source for the apparatus. Perhaps some sort of harmonic resonance within the energies contained in the soul gem to bring heat to a small boiler? Too early to say conclusively. That does raise the question of where they get the liquid for the boiler, however. Ah, that was strange. I thought I just saw something moving beyond the barred door. It looked vaguely humanoid. I wonder if it could be an undiscovered automaton. I'm going to move my bedroll down here to see if I can catch another glimpse of it. This is all so exciting. Apparently too exciting for this one, as there is no sign of him. Hmm. I must see if there is some mechanism that will remove these bars. But first, I may need to deal with the Khajiit I heard earlier. If they have not already dealt with themselves through their own foolishness in this place, This seems to lead deeper into this area. But I need to make sure I didn't miss exploring another part of this chamber. Must be thorough, always thorough. What? Ah! Oh, blast! Dealt with easily enough. Ah, a torch dropped recently. Perhaps the Khajiit I seek came this way. What is this? An ant oh, blast it all! Yes, it would seem they came this way. However, this seems like an entirely different path. I do not wish to forget to explore the other one. I will continue here for now. Curse my memory if I fail to go back. Ah, oh, but... Hmm. Thought for a moment this might lead to a point of connection with the other path. Hmm. Of some significant value. Blasted contraptions! What? Who is this, brother? Another of the smooth skins looking for food? This one wasn't trapped with us. No. No! 
What was that? Ha! Let's see. Acceptable values. Hmm. Let's see what they were up to here. This one is at his wit's end. I signed Jadar and myself up for this expedition to try to get him clean of the skooma. I brought a small supply to try bring him down slowly, but the storm has had us trapped in the glacier for weeks. The others have not yet caught on that one with fur should not shake so much from the cold, but I've run out of the little skooma I brought, and Jadar is getting pretty bad. He's started hallucinating creatures coming out of the ice and the ruins. The others are starting to think he may be behind Veili's disappearance, but I know he would never do something like that. Well, he's dead now, so you need not be concerned about his skooma addiction anymore. Mana's journal. It's been about a week since Veli went missing, and now Endrast is gone too. We found blood leading over to the barred off doorway, but Sula seems to think that they found a way through and that they are trying to cut him out of the discovery. He keeps saying that we need to press on. We've managed to break through into another section of the ruins, an am animunculori where the dwarves would produce their automatons. We learned the hard way that the metal creatures are still alive in there, and it hasn't improved Yag's mood at all. She holds that the Khajiit brothers aren't involved with the disappearances and has been keeping a hard eye on Sula. The rations have all but run out, and we are going to have to decide soon whether to brave the storm or try to push further into the ruins. I don't know if the echoes of screams I've heard in my sleep are those of our missing comrades or my own nightmares. Hmm. I have some small concern that I am going in the wrong direction. See, this is where I want to be. This is where I am. It does seem that I... Could very well be getting closer, but... Hmm. I feel compelled to once again consider my life. Hmm. Likely spot for an ambush. Yes. You see, but I am one step ahead of you. Could this possibly propel me upward? Ah, not quickly enough, not far enough. Ah, oh, blast! 
lost it all! I saw the fumes in the air but a moment too late. Whoever built this place, if they still live, they shall pay for that. Hmm. More likely ambush points. Ha! Yes, and you? There's something over here. Ah. See, I may be able to unlock this. <clears throat> eh. Not quite. Ah, no. Let's see. Try a bit over here. Another lock! This better be worth my time and effort. Ah! Ah! Bless it all! Ah! This! What? Ah! Blast! Oh. Yeah. Ah, let's try. Uh, idea. Yes. Ah, yes, I do believe I'm getting better at this. Hmm. Maybe good for disenchanting or selling. Yes, good, good. Very well. More locks. <sighs> I may need to learn a spell appropriate to this world to better deal with these nuisances. Ah. Hmm. Acceptable, I suppose. Hmm. Am I going the wrong way? Ah, I might have made a wrong turn here at some point. What is this? I see you, creature. Hmm. Deeper into the reaches of this place, but not perhaps where I want to be. Hmm. 
Is there... This map is nearly useless to me. I see, yes, there are multiple levels. I must go upward from here. Very well. I grow impatient. Hmm. This would seem to be the path leading closer to my destination. Hmm. Ah, yes, good. Ah, a diversion at the moment must press onward toward my goal. Yes. Now we come closer to it, I think. Ah, oh, blast. There we are. Ha! You'll not push me off. Here. 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 Die. If you were even alive to begin with. Yes! Excellent! Ah! But still, no Septimus to be found! Let's take a look at our map again. <sighs> Still far more of a journey than I would like. Nevertheless, if I will come into my full power, I must obtain the Elder Scroll. And so I push onward. But then I'll have to wait. Until next time, thanks for watching. Bye-bye. For more chat about geek entertainment, answers to your questions, and news from the wider world of Christian geekery, get the Christian Geek Central podcast today on iTunes and other podcast services.